We have four teams that are usually not the traditional ones that lead the league. And last day of the competition, we are not really, really sure who is, going, who is still going to be number one. So we expect that today is going to be very, very explosive. Two of the teams pale blue colors uh, throughout the opening two rounds, and they are in a green and to white horizontal striped uh, shirt this afternoon. They made three changes coming into this encounter. Out goes John Akbawu, Debekemi, Tanakarore, and Shea Dauda, who picked up that injury in their previous match against Quara United. And in their places, Kabiru Zibrin, Usha Ediora from injury in their first match, and Ben Francis. You see, they have not delivered. And uh, we have that team, but particularly unlucky Nasrawa United has underperformed. Wiki Tourist were to win and Para United were to win as well. They both end up on four points. Nasrawa United, even with their victory, in space there for Ibrahim Abubakar. But uh, once again, it's always their style on the other. Femi Babatunde, of course, uh, will try to be a little more disciplined and not to be caught offside as much as he was before. Do get away with it this time. Still, Sarwa United, Emma Onu finding from the danger zone. Suddenly, something on here for Ikechuku. And that's the way shots are going to come in. That's Izzy Mora. And the shots uh, bouncing off the wet surface here at the Abuja National Stadium could cause problematic for both Mokike and Femi Thomas. From Ikechuku, allowed the ball to roll in front of him. Good left shot. But no power behind it, very easy for the goalkeeper to stop. The Champions League for themselves will at least confirm a position in Africa. That's not why United are looking for three points to go top of the table with Ocean Boys on goal difference. Uber and Onu. Bustling away though is Izimora. This time he will pick up the free kick. Taking quickly by Salisu. Ben Francis, just uh, a little overstruck towards Ikechuku, who I don't think was anticipating the pass anyway. He hadn't uh, made any... The ball's come back to Ezimora now. Now there's a bit of space. Ikechuku oh, trying to get through to Jerry Takov. Ezimora. Ikechuku beaten by... So defense into attack goes uh, Nasrawa United and uh, well, Ali Aliyah Yahaya bundling uh, Shinedo Izimora off the ball. This was a totally unnecessary foul. Just shoved the demand of the ball and in a very dangerous position. This is shooting range position. So one with a very good kick. Zimora moves away from the ball. He was uh, going to get in there. The, the shot comes in and it's uh, blazed over the crossbar. Ben Francis not finding the space he was looking for. Yora. Now Izimora. Trying, pressing, looking for those openings. Force the wall back and there's a four man wall in front of the free kick. Izimora. A run over the ball and it's taken by Francis off the upright and straight into the goal. Oh, the keeper spelled it into the back of the net. Oh dear, oh dear. Very second goal to score in this entire tournament. And yet they are already in second position. And another decent cross out to Ikechuku and his first touch. Ikechuku. Very much in control of matters now. Ah, oh, Nasarawa United. Sure that their coach would want. Izimora finds Sunny Ahmed. This is Chiprin. Disappointing stuff. If they uh, fail to compete. But with the introduction of Haruna, they had some fresh instructions as well. They have up the end. 